If you finally decided to do upgrade uh, for your accounting application, such as Microsoft Dynamics GP or earlier versions, um, uh, Great Plains Dynamics, we would like to show you the difference in the user interface. Let's assume that you are on uh, Great Plains um, Dynamics version 7.5. In this case, your user interface would look like this. You would see uh, toolbars on the left side. Uh, you would see um, if you click on the toolbar like cards, um, then you will see uh, menus, and then you click on sales, you would see the pallets um, with the nail which you can fix or unfix. And then you can go directly to the uh, transaction, and here you, at, the, at the bottom of left side you see a uh, navigation. Um, you can you, you have such features as smart list, and you you can have shortcuts as well available or you can hide them. Um, now let's take a look at more older versions such as um, Dynamics GP 5.5 as you see in this case. Um, this interface is more archaic. Um, you can uh, let, let us show you a customer card. As you see you can do it this way. Um, this is this is your old interface. No, now let's assume that you are on even older version of um, Great Plains, which would be Great Plains Accounting for Windows. You may have similar for DOS. <coughs> this application is very different, and uh, navigation is uh, more complex. Um, for you, it may be simple, but for the um, um, current Dynamics users it may be difficult. Now let's go back to the newest version. That's what you're supposed to have at the end. Let me log in. As you see, this is version 10. Go to Lesson Company and show you interface from there. Okay. This is version 10, as you can see on this uh, screen. Uh, interface is, diff is different. Instead of toolbars on the top, you see uh, cascading menus, as you may um, get used to, to that in. Um, um, Microsoft Outlook. Let's open customer window. You see you can recognize it and um, probably uh, it should be intuitive for you. Uh, now you see uh, you have on the left side you have uh, alternative navigation which would be which would switch you series uh, like customer screen could be accessed by clicking on sales and then in cards you can click and open the same window and pull the customer. Now it also has uh, such features as um, smart list, where you can export uh, to Excel. Let's give you an example of inventory items. Don't forget to unlimit this um, number of records to something higher than 1000 in the case if you have a bunch of the inventory items. And you can also export to Excel like you would have it for version 7.5 as, as we looked at earlier. This concludes our presentation. If you have um, If you have questions, uh, please feel free to go to our website, Alba Spectrum. And um, give us a call 866-528-0577 or help at albaspectrum.com. Thank you for watching.